Adoni Benares is live at University of the Pacific to explain what this is all about. Adoni, good morning. Good morning, how are you? We're doing well, thank you. So we see some dancing going on in the background. Uh, if you can explain what we're seeing before we get into exactly what you all do at this camp, that'd be great. This morning you're seeing a Romanian dance called Schwapa Chorbanesca, a rural dance that has uh, choreographed in 1970s. And it's being reviewed by some of our students with one of our special guests at camp. Wow, so I mean, this is the 72nd year you guys have done oh. this. And we've talked about this, we were talking about this earlier. Uh -huh. People from around the world actually come. What, why do you all continue to do this every year? It was started in 1948, and Stockton is known as the largest and most impressive folk dance camp uh, across the world. So indeed, people come across the world, it's fun, it's interesting, and you get to meet people from many, many different cultures. This is so cool. So how many different types of dancing do these uh, participants learn? So each year, you learn seven to eight different nationalities wow. of dances. And then, the, yeah, and then the nationalities change every year. So what are they learning this year? This is uh, Romanian. You're also learning Armenian, Argentinian, United States, Chinese, Polish, and Greek. That is wow. amazing. So yes. what, what happens after the camp? Yeah. So everyone comes, they have a good time, they meet new people, they learn some dance moves, and then they just go home? Or do they go and compete yeah. somewhere or show off the moves? Not competition, but recreational folk dancing. They go back to their local cities, and almost every city has got a folk dance group of you know 20 to 80 people, and they get together weekly or biweekly, and you share the dances you've learned, and then you have a couple hours of just recreational dancing. How I'm fun! Into this. I, I am know. too. So, uh, do is there still an opportunity for people to be part of this to join in? Absolutely. Uh, two great websites. Besides Facebook, you can look at folkdance.com, which is the site for the Northern California Folk Dance Federation. And for Stockton, you can look at folkdancecamp.org, and you'll find a ton of information about any class in any place in the world. So, Adoni, you know, we are some dancing folk over yeah. here on Good Day, so we <laughs> wanted to stick around for another hour. Coming up in just, actually, just a few minutes here, we want to see one more dance. Can you tell us what we're going to see in just a little bit? You'll see uh, Armenian. Oh. You'll see some oh. dances from Armenia being done. Sweet. Fantastic. Deal. Well, thank you so much. Yeah. Thank we'll, you so we'll much. We'll check in with you in a little bit. That's yeah. pretty cool. I like it. I like it. Thanks for the time. I keep hearing the double, the boom, boom. Yeah.